in November of 2001. We went to Kosovo for six months. It was my first deployment. You know, it's a peacekeeping mission, so it's mostly humanitarian. The Army does so much more humanitarian things that people don't hear about. In Iraq, we pulled security while they're giving out eyeglasses, soccer balls, and coats. They're doing immunizations. Shoes was a big thing. By this time, I'm a, I'm a sergeant, me five. We go to Afghanistan in 2006. So my job was, if we thought we had an IED, I was I would go out by myself and go probe it and see if it was an IED or not. January 5th, 2010 is when I got blown up for the first time. It went off under my seat. I thought my driver had a pothole. And I just happened to look out the window and I'm like, that's my tire. And it's 100 feet from the truck. And then two days later, they hit, we got hit again. They drove a dump truck full of explosives in that compound that we were on. Blew a 42-foot hole in the wall. Uh, killed my platoon sergeant. You know, I, I was I was noticing there was something wrong. And I, that's when I started going and seeing doctors. And these two blasts so close together that that's what my brain just was like, whoa, I can't do this anymore. You know, I definitely, I missed, I missed my job. You know, part of me still wants to be over there.